Gather round this Philly favorite. It's National Cheesesteak Day. Cheesesteaks are more of a culture around here. It's in our blood. It's more than a sandwich. It's, it's part of our. It's part of what we do. The guys at Delco Steaks wanted to make this day even more special by inviting dozens of people out to this Brumall Swim Club to see who can eat the fastest. Each of these cheesesteaks is two feet long, has two pounds of meat, and we asked for a calorie count. They said it's somewhere in the few thousand range. It is a major feat for somebody to take it down, especially in one minute and 40 seconds. That's the amount of time it took Dan Kennedy to win the first round. Take manageable bites, just swallow it, you know, and keep pushing it with water until you run out of cheesesteak. The participants say this is much harder than a hot dog eating contest, and the bread is not their friend. I didn't expect the buns, the roll to be uh, toasted, and that made it much more difficult. You may not see it in their faces, and fortunately I didn't see anyone using these buckets, but some people actually enjoy this. It's like a Super Bowl, but for eating, you know, it's a lot of fun, and uh, it's entertaining, you draw a big crowd, you know, and everybody's cheering. I've seen a lot of things, but I've never seen anything like that. That was pure, like, that's a competitive eater. The winners won cash and even a tropical trip where they can try to work off some of what they ate today. In Brumall, Drew Smith, NBC 10 News. <laughs> wow. It's what we do. Wow. When you guys watch that, do you ever wonder how you would do it? Like, I kind of feel like I could compete. <laughs> you do, Britt? <laughs> I'm proud of yeah, you. Yeah, why not? I don't know. It seems I'm like something fun to try. I'd need the Heimlich maneuver or something. <laughs> I know. That was a lot they were downing. Mm, I'm, I'm impressed.